May 1st marks the one-year anniversary of the death of Osama bin Laden. CNAS has asked several of its experts to look back and reflect on what has changed in U.S. policy over the last year and the implications for the future. Dave Barno, Senior Advisor and Senior Fellow, joins us now. Was the death of Osama bin Laden a game changer for the war on terror? Well, I think it was. I mean, bin Laden uh, it was the driving force behind al-Qaeda. He was the inspiration and the mastermind of the 9-11 attacks. And I think his death has uh, sent a significant blow against uh, the al-Qaeda organization all around the world. It hasn't ended the, the uh, threat from al-Qaeda, but it certainly dealt it a very severe setback. Can you describe some of the consequences of his death? Well, I think regionally uh, the most prominent consequence has been uh, the impact on the U.S. relationship with Pakistan, given that bin Laden was killed by American forces going into Pakistan. That, that relationship's on the mend, uh, but it's had a big impact. In Afghanistan, uh, interestingly, it's had, from best I can see, very little impact on the uh, U.S. and Afghan and international uh, war against the Taliban insurgency there. Did bin Laden's death deliver al-Qaeda a fatal blow? I think al-Qaeda has changed dramatically in the last several years from a, an organization that was regionally based primarily in South and Central Asia to one that now has global franchises. It's uh, become a, uh, an industry in a sense that has grown up independently, uh, inspired by bin Laden certainly, but uh, with now franchise organizations in the Horn of Africa, uh, in, in Sub-Saharan Africa, uh, in other parts of the world. So it, it is a, a still a very dangerous organization, one that uh, is adapted to uh, the threat we've placed it under in the last 10 years.